going into the playoffs with Armstrong finally getting a start in the most important game of the year alongside Ryan Gall. The 4-4-2, but with no Yaboa, it's Tani Olawashe who makes a start up front with Bongi Longwane. One thing for sure, though, they both want to fish, finish higher than eighth or ninth and avoid that wild card game. And Minnesota, they're going in the right direction. The Whitecaps, as of late, yeah, to give one up off of a free kick so far this season as well. So bid right into Yohei Takoka. Did not bother him much here in the early going to BC Place. But uh, strong as he's challenged all of us just at the edge of the area dropping it back for Pereira on the left foot and off target so you heard a thump against the end boards there just the if they swept them there could be an outside chance of the top four but it would need to be a sweep oh the shade caught up in the legs of Ranko Veselinovic it was on a challenge conducting traffic although it seems pretty calm and cool in the box yeah no need for that Tapius floating one up far post Arcanic right in to a good start with this best 11. Pereira looking for Oloashei, Oloashei cutting it back, okay, Takaoka coming up to the edge of the six to make the stop. On this left side, curling it towards the spot. Ufik dealt with it, right back up for Longwane, trying to tee somebody up at the edge of the box. There was some cute confusion there, and now at the edge of the area, it's going to the spot! We'll see a look here, but that left heel gets left out by Laborda. And there's a better look at it right yeah, there. right down the line, inside the box. I don't think there's a question. Good run from Harvey too. Nice aggressive positive run. Dotson staring at the ball giving away nothing to Yohei Takoka who stands on his line. Exhale. Here comes Dotson. To his left. Easily slammed home by Hassani Dotson. 1-0 Minnesota in the 24th minute. And that is a beautifully taken penalty from the man who not often will take the penalties for Minnesota United. No Kelvin Yabo in the starting lineup here today. He's expert the into the corner. Takaoka goes the wrong way, but even if he went the right way. Blooms there and now down the right side for Laborda in some space. Whip that in. Gold, a touch for Anakubi, and it's an own goal! Wrong level. Anakubi with some space on the left side, and as it's popped up, he just shoots towards goal. I think he's trying to find Brian White there. And it goes off of Tapias, who makes the play on it. And Dane St. Clair can't react. They might be bringing this ball back here for Minnesota. But Here's the call from Remy Tushan. After review, number 25 from Vancouver committed a foul prior to the goal. The final decision is no goal. So, so Remy Tushan willing to connect those dots. No goal. Minnesota remains up. Here in the first half of BC Place. As the crowd, you could hear exhale. They thought maybe finally there was something building for the home side, but not to be. Veselinovic comes over to tap that off the feet of Oloshe. And is that going to be a yellow card on Veselinovic? Or is it on the Minnesota player? Minnesota's not expected at all given the latest run of form for Minnesota. Oluwashe on the yellow right now. Ahmed on the turnover. Gold for Armstrong from distance. Tries his shot. That one is blocked by Harvey. Anakubi for Armstrong. Looking to cut it back. Gets it to Anakubi on the left foot. Tried to play it on the outside. And it's a save made by Dane St. Clair. I wonder with Gold's health, is it him or is it Raposo? It will be Gold towards goal, but just curled too much away from that near post. Didn't test Dane St. Clair. Many on the day, see how they can convert on a set play opportunity. Rosales, left footed delivery. That one went right to the post. Anakubi was there to send it away. Now back to the spot, flicked towards goal. Raposo, or Brian White, pardon me, awkwardly flings at it, doesn't get the ball far. And Minnesota United now forced to chase it back. Comes in to calm things down a little bit. Vite adding some 
Spice to it once more, and now the yellow card comes up for Kelvin Yeboah. Where we've seen him play, he started as a center forward in this game. Discipline to get back and help out in that position now. For Halter. For Anakumi! And right at the post. Dane St. Clair there to make the stop. But and that ball's through. Masanvi. Is he onside? On the right foot, stopped by Taco. Got the flag is up anyhow. LAFC don't miss the crucial match. Sunday at 7.30 p.m. Eastern on MLS Season Pass. It's another early one. And Dean St. Clair has been up to some hijinks on these goal kicks. Incurs the yellow card. And somehow maintaining possession of the ball. Ryan Raposo. Back for Berhalter. Raposo taken down. And there's a card coming now for Diaz. Sends that into the white cap half. Ludwig with the first touch. Krylak competing there. Can't get it. That ball's over the top. Brian White will track it down. Endless energy for the American. Raposo stuck in tight. Has to give that to Brian White. The chip shot is there. Krylock got a piece, but drops harmlessly into the feet of Dane St. Clair. That is Utvik, and now Vite sends the ball in. White got a piece. Not enough. Raposo, edge of the box, and that one just wide of the post. Might have been the best effort for the Whitecaps all night long. Jogs it away, down the pitch. Yaboa, Rosales, back to Yaboa. It's an open net off the post. And Remy Tushan blows the whistle to end this match.